Congratulations on your purchase of the Huica Quick Plate System, the most advanced wheel mounting tooling available. What comes with your Huica Quick Plate System? Huica Quick Plates can be purchased as a set of three plates or individually. Whether you buy the complete set of Huica Quick Plates or individual plates, you will also receive interchangeable tips. These tips fit on all three quick plates. How the Hawika Quick Plate System Works Hawika Quick Plates are designed to mount wheels on your balancer in the same way they are mounted on the car. On your vehicle, the lug nuts provide equal pressure to the wheel to hold it against the hub. Hawika Quick Plates apply pressure to the wheel on the balancer in the same way the lug nuts do. Each pin replicates a lug nut. Setup for the Hoika Quick Plate System Begin by choosing the correct quick plate for the wheel you want to balance. Choose the number 4 plate for wheels with either 4 or 8 lug nuts, the number 6 plate is used on 6 bolt hole patterns, and the number 5 plate on 5 lug vehicles. Next choose the correct tip to match the profile of the lug nut. Your quick plate comes with a selection of tips that fit most common nuts. Usually the tip's profile will be similar to the lug, however some are quite different. Use the long, narrow tips for aftermarket wheels. When choosing a tip, the most important feature to look for is a good seat in the lug hole on the wheel. It must have clearance on the sides of the lug hole and must bottom out in the same place as the OE lug nut. It's simple to attach the tips to the quick plate. Each tip should seat all the way down on the pin. It's important that only matching tips be used. Tips of different lengths will cause balancing errors. Make sure the pins are disengaged by twisting the locking mechanism on the back plate one eighth of a turn counterclockwise. When the quick plate is unlocked, the pins will move in unison. Position the pins close to the lug spacing of the wheel you are about to balance. Place the quick plate into the lug holes of the wheel. The pins will adjust to the correct position with a little wiggle of the quick plate. A proper seat of the pins into the wheel is critical to performance. After the pins are properly seated, twist the locking mechanism one eighth of a turn clockwise. Do not over tighten. Mounting the Hoika quick plate. The Hoika Quick Plate requires the use of a pressure spring on your balancer. Balancers with closed bell housings have the pressure spring installed below the faceplate. Balancers with an open bell housing must have the pressure spring installed. Slide a cone against the pressure plate or pressure spring. For best results, use the Hoika Duo Collet instead of a cone. When using the Duo Collet on a closed bell housing, you must first install a spacer ring. Then install the duo collet with the small diameter facing outward. The wheel is mounted on the balancer after the cone or Hoika duo collet. The quick plate faces the wheel and the pins are aligned into the lug holes. Proper seating of the quick plate pins into the lug holes is essential for accurate results. Tighten the quick plate onto the wheel with a Hoika quick nut. You are now ready to begin the balancing process. Removing the Hoika quick plate. After you have run your normal balancing procedure and the proper results are achieved, you can dismount the quick plate. Ease the pressure off the quick nut by unscrewing it two turns. Then press the quick release trigger. The release trigger allows the quick nut to easily slide from the shaft. In between balancing wheels, stow the quick plate in its convenient storage solution. Remember, the locked quick plate is ready for the next wheel in the set.